What's good guys, my name is Lego Fox and welcome to Call of Cthulhu. I noticed this game when I was browsing the PlayStation Store. Fuck off Dragon Age, you're not important right now. <laughs> uh, I first noticed this game when I was browsing through the PlayStation Store and I saw that it was on sale. Because I noticed this game when it came out and I was like, I want to play it, but it was expensive and I'm poor. <laughs> and it was like 60% off today. So I bought it. Let's enter the madness. Just the brightness. That's fine like that. Loading profile, please wait. Okay. Nice, just shows off my name. Right, uh, let's check the settings out quick. To see if... Good subtitles are on. Crosshair on or off. Okay, that's fine. Controls. Uh, that's all fine. Okie smokey then. Let's uh, hop into it in an empty slot. Chapter 1. Okay, let's enter the madness once again. If I am mad, it is mercy. May the gods pity the man who... I didn't read that fast enough. Saying... No, no. H.P. Lovecraft. I like him. He's a good man. Ooh, that's nice and juicy. We don't know what's happening. Game saved. Nice. Didn't even do anything. <laughs> okay, to move. Got it. To look. Now this, this game looks good, but I'm starting to think it might be a spooky horror game. And if it is, I ain't digging that. I'm going to play it anyway. But if it's a spooky horror game, then uh, I'm scared. Is that a poor Sharku? I think that might be a poor little Sharku. Oh no! It's poor little Sharku's head. What are my buttons doing? Oh, I can crouch. Oh, there's a lean. Okay. So we can't go through this door, I take it. No. It's locked. Okay, let's go through this little crawl hole then. Uh. Was this said locked door or is this a different one? I think it might be a different one. Okie day then. Okay, you must light up, light up items. Okay, I've got a light now. Uh, what's this? Bolt cutter. Ah. I can go through here now. Is there anything down here? So, let's have a look. See if there is. Oh. Nope, nope. My controller is vibrating like crazy. I take it I'm not allowed down there. Because there was a big thing. And it kind of made my controller vibrate. So. Let's pretend that never happened. Bolt cutters. Nice. Okay, let's 
Okay. I take it I'm going in there. I can't even go through this door here. So I must have to go through here. Yep. God. I don't want to. There's a killer whale there. Wait, is this not where I woke up? Oh god. I you have been chosen. Oh god. So it's gonna jump, isn't it? That was a bad idea. And I take it that's me. Oh, was that all a dream? <laughs> I wonder why I still take these things. Okay. Sleeping pills. Let's look at our diary. Pierce Investigations Agency. Dark water, inhabitants, places, cult. So we get skills and our sanity. Mental trauma. Right. Clues. Nothing. Okay. Inventory. We got a lighter. And sleeping pills. Been too long since I've slept in a bed. The lost battalion. Holding your position and obeying orders. That isn't courage. Right. So he was in the war, I take it then? I used to be an avid reader. Right, but you're not anymore? The What's Wentworth this? agency doesn't attract top-notch cases. Okay. I'm gonna look at everything in this room before we leave. Married Ooh. woman runs off with her girlfriend. The husband couldn't understand it. Right, so it's just... Okay. Closed case. Why would you take a closed case? Good old story of blackmail in a speakeasy. Right. So apparently this game Natural is just installed science, now. <laughs> linguistics, archaeology. Mm hmm. Oh, that's too quiet. I can't even turn it on. Have a drink. This will affect your destiny. What? Okay then. I'm listening. Are you Edward Pierce? Private investigator contracted by the Wentworth Detective Agency? That's correct. Hello, Mr. Pierce. I'm Lucy Sheriffield, in charge of investigators over at Wentworth. I'm calling because of a problem with your file. A fire has destroyed some of our documents. Is that right. right? I'm so very sorry, but I have to collect your personal information yet again. <sighs> okay, so we've got eight character points that we can put in. 
Right. Occultism. The occult sciences. And we've only got one in there. And one in medicine. So we've got 40% professionalism. Oh, sorry. 40% in this. Profe professionalism's 40%. And think about this. I don't know. I'm so confused, okay? So we'll put one into that. Uh, put you in there. Two in there. So we've got five more. Put one in strength, hidden spots, medicine. Put two. Um. What's this one? It's your ability to influence those you talk to by the power of speech. Yes, put one in there. There we go. Yes. What's wrong? As you know, we wish to closely monitor the progress of our contractors. Right. And Huh. Work is scarce. Mr. Pierce, you know as well as I do, there's never been more investigative work than now. But are those cases worth it? They're worth not losing your license. Show yourself worthy of the Wentworth Detective Agency, and we might keep you on the payroll. Mr. Pierce, do you still... Oh, it's a cutscene. I'm coming. Sir, I came here on the advice of a person whom I hold in high esteem, and I must say that I expected anything but a drunkard's lair. You're free to leave any time, sir. Do you know to whom you speak? Stephen Webster, industrialist and art collector. All of Boston knows you. Tell me, <laughs> Mr. Pierce. Are you capable of handling a new case, or are you simply a deadbeat inebriate? If you come to me, it means you're desperate. Nobody believes me. They take me for right. a fool. Sarah, my little girl, she is dead. I know. You must know of her. She was Sarah Hawkins. The painter? Yes. Everyone knows her work. The police accuse her of killing her family. They all died in a fire. Sarah, her husband, and Simon, my grandson. I can't do anything for a woman who is already dead. Find out the truth. They say she was mad, but I know that's a lie. She would never have done such a thing. But if you have no proof... I've brought all that I have. Look. I want you to look carefully at this painting. Tell me all the assumptions that come to mind. Oh god, okay. Alright, bring it on. What am I supposed to find? Tell me... Tell me if this is the work of madness. Or if, on the contrary, you manage to detect some logic. A rationality to follow so that I may understand it. Is that all you want from me? Yes. Please. All right. I'll look at your picture. That's all you've got? The paint. No objective. I placed a file on your desk. It contains everything I have on the affair. Okay. So let's look at this quick. So, examine the Hawking's file. Examine the painting and examine the file. Okay. Oh, here comes part of me. <coughs> uh, none of that crap we need. So this, a let's have a look at this. Some sketches of the Hawkins family. Rather thin. Right. Okay. We'll keep that in mind. And we'll have a look at this. Its strange beauty isn't enough to hide the feeling of dread it carries. 
So, Mr. Pierce, what do you make of these elements? Right, uh, you're asking the wrong guy. I read about her mental fragility. Um, in the police report, something's not right with this story. Find out about White House 36 and where did Sarah Hawkins live? Uh, the this one. label mentions Warehouse 36. That's right. It came with Sarah's last painting. Then you think your daughter could have been the sender? That is what you must find out. Go to Darkwater. Find Warehouse 36. Okay. Um. Dark. This one. Never heard of the place. Where is that? It's a small remote island off the coast of Boston. Sarah lived there with her son and her husband. I suppose you want to ship me off there. Darkwater holds the secret regarding my daughter, Mr. Pierce. You must uncover it. Why can't you go there? Right, um... You must this one. tell me if what the police suggest about the mental state of your daughter is true. No. Sarah had visions. Everyone knew that. She never would have heard a fly. She only thought she saw things saw things what do you mean by that i never knew what she meant by that my daughter was an enigmatic figure mr pierce you must find out the truth about her life and death okay something's not right with this story her husband was a big deal on the island but the police are sticking to the accident Though they mentioned Sarah's mental state was fragile. I believe you are right, sir. This case is not as simple as it appears. I am aware of that. I believe there is more to this case than just an accident. Um. I that's all the information I need. To understand. I'm willing to do anything for my daughter to recover her honor. Quiet down. I'm on your side. Let's sum things up. An artist dies with her family in a house fire. Your only clue is a sort of promontory painting sent from dark water right before her death. Correct. And the rumors about her supposed folly. Which you don't totally deny. Find that warehouse. Find out the truth regarding Sarah Hawkins' death. You'll be handsomely compensated. All right. I'll take the case. I'll go to dark water. And look into the death of your daughter. Thank you, Mr. Pierce. I didn't expect any less coming from a man in your situation. Huh. <laughs> also. It's queer. But it's not like I have a choice. Okay, leave for dark water. Dark water. I think I've got a book on the North Atlantic. I'll no doubt find some. Dark water is off the coast of Boston. But I've never heard of it. According to this book. It was often mentioned during whale hunting times at the end of the 19th century. But it seems to have been shunned since then. Okay. All I have to do is go to the port. I just hope that I can find a boat able to take me to dark water. Natural sciences, linguistics, archaeology. Is that creepy ass painting again? Uh, what's this? Learning Medicine, Volume 1. Okay, and then that was in here, which is nothing again. Okay, Smirker then. Right, let's have a look in our journal. Uh, dark Water. So, Stephen Webster. And then the Hawkins. Which are all deceased. Okay. Dark water. No cult. Clues. These two. Right. And then inventory. Okay. Right. I'm going to end it here for today. So if you have enjoyed this video. 
please hit that like button, that subscribe button, comment in the comment section down below. Also hit that little notification bell, that way you know every single time I upload a video. Um, check out my Twitter as well, because I'll always tweet when I upload a video. And my Patreon will be down below as well, because every little helps. And until next time, I shall see you when I see you. Yeah, yeah, Peace. I ain't the first with the curse, with the thirst that I wanna be better, not worse, man, it hurts. I'm on the earth with my words, and I put them all together in cert, cause I wanna have worth. Working hella hard till they put me in the dirt. Gonna go far, man, listen to my words. Gonna be a star, man, life's like a blur when you're working this hard.